Now moving on, Bolivia has sent out a high level delegation on an international mission to regain its right to access to the sea. Former Bolivian President Carlos Mesa, current spokesperson for Bolivia's ongoing legal case in the International Court of Justice in The Hague, centered around Bolivia's efforts to regain sovereign access to its former Pacific coast lost to neighboring Chile, embarked upon a media tour targeting several international institutions. His first stop was the United Nations, where he met with General Secretary Ban Ki-moon. Our hope was, and we believe it has been well received, to explain to the General Secretary the reasons which Bolivia is pursuing this case, what it consists of, what are some of the legal elements that Bolivia is basing its arguments upon. And of course, we believe that our case is just and that we have a chance of winning. Carlos Mesa's tour includes additional stops at the Organization of American States in Washington, D.C., as well as the International Court of Justice in The Hague. He is part of a team of former Bolivian officials, including ex-foreign minister Armando Loaiza, who are coordinating the country's efforts to recuperate access to its former Pacific coast. Chilean officials also announced an upcoming diplomatic tour to present their arguments to the international community. Chile has filed an objection with The Hague, questioning the court's jurisdiction in the case. Bolivia has until November 14th to respond to the motion. Reporting from La Paz, this is David Dordi with Telesur. And thanks to David.